if you grew up playing soccer, you would know there are that many different types of kids on the field. Some that are good, some that are, you know, okay, then some that are annoying, and some that just need to get out, you're done, just leave. I'm gonna go through as many of them as I can today because why the hell not? Let's start off with the goalkeeper. I don't know why they did this, I really don't, that you'd switch around goalkeepers so that everyone got a turn. I'm a striker, not a bloody goalkeeper, mate. So if I miss anything or if I mess up as the goalkeeper, don't blame me. Okay, the goalkeeper, usually, especially as a kid, is always up themselves. They're always thinking they're better than everyone else, you know? Oh, I'm the keeper, I'm gonna save all the goals. They can't goalkeep for shit. They wore their hat backwards and everything, you know, they tried to look cool, they brought their own gear and stuff like that. Like, mate, you, you have the easiest job in the world. You don't have to save anything. They are nothing compared to the next person. The kid who tries to do skills, they think they're messy. They, they're they not. They suck. Just They just they get the ball and they just, oh, oh look, look, look at me. I can, do, I can do all these tricks. And then, and then they get the ball taken off and then they're like, what the hell? Why, why didn't anyone? Why, why was, where was everyone? They're usually the person that comes up with all the excuses. The, the ground, it was the ground, but yeah. The ground, yeah, no, no. Where were you? Where were you? Where were you? The kid who always says he was open when he never was. Pass to me, pass to me. You have like 50 people around you, mate. Then when you don't pass it to them, they get upset with you. You, they, then you, then you pass it to them. They lose the ball, and then they still get upset. You can't win. If you are that player, or you know someone that is that player, go suck one. Now this next player, I don't know what it was when you played soccer as a kid, there was always one or two oh, that were just aggressive. Like this person, he was just there to, to beat the living crap out of everyone. It wasn't a personal thing. They just did it to anyone. Which, not gonna lie, I respect that. I I, I do. I, I I was always up for a competition, mate. Tell me I'm wrong. Every single team had that one player that played rep or national at a higher level. And there was always one person in the entire competition that everyone was scared of. That one kid whose dad is the ref. We've all played against the team that has someone like that. Boy, howdy, it's annoying. Moving on. Next, we got the, oh, come on, ref, kid. Yes, because there was always one of them. Anytime anything would happen, ref, he's out. Ref, ref, he's offside. Ref, he's offside. Mate, shut the fuck up. Ah, the kid who was secretly really good, but he just, he, this, this this was the kid who was quick, he had skills, he was really, really, really good. He was just quiet, contempt, mate. I respect those people. I respect, it. if you're one of those players, I respect you, mate. And last but not least, this wouldn't be a soccer video without mentioning the bloody hog. The one kid that doesn't know how to pass it. It's not even a skill, just kick the ball to someone else. That's all we're asking, mate. They act like, you know, it's the end of the world. Oh, you know, I could have scored that goal, you know. Oh, I was about to get around this person, but he got the ball off me. Mate, the hog is the worst player on the field. Unless you are a striker, no reason to be a hog. Absolutely none. Every team had someone like that. Just pass it! And, and tell me if I'm right or wrong about any of these, because I'm pretty sure there might be a few that I'm missing. But other than that, mate, that's all she wrote, mate. I'll see you in the next video. Take it easy.